All right, how's it going? Dave coming to you from the mobile command post and I'm using this filter on the video thing. This is supposed to be the, mil the Millennium Falcon. I thought it was cool because it I'm in the truck. I got this really dark background. I was going to shoot it with that, but this is pretty neat. Anyway, it's getting late at night here because I had to head on over to Salt Lake City, which is where I am now. And, well, I had some bad weather on the way here, so it took me a little bit longer than normal. And I'm telling you, it's a real drag driving on the snow. But it is fun playing with this video filter. So how do you relate that to marketing? Well, trying new things, that's one, but as far as the snow and the weather conditions go, that's one of the things as a trucker that I run into constantly. Construction, uh, detours, weather, plows, accidents, all these things that can slow me down or make me have to take a different way. And it's a great metaphor for your business because there's always something going on you never know what it's going to be and at any given moment your schedule or your plans can change and you must adapt to move ahead it's it's the same thing as your business now where this becomes a hassle is when you decide to try a different way too soon in other words you don't put enough effort into the direction you're headed the tool you're using the platform, the paid advertising, whatever it is, everybody seems to have a tendency to not put enough effort in. It's, it's as a culture, we seem to be always looking for something that's happening right away. And I spoke about this in a different video where you've been trained to fail because they, from kindergarten or first grade on, they're teaching you there's an answer to every question that they have. If you give the right answer, then you move ahead, you get rewarded. And if you give any other answer, then of course it's wrong and you, you fail. That's not how business works and it's not how life works. You've got to continually try different things and whatever's working now might not work next week. It all depends on your specific market the people you are specifically talking to within that market it's at first it's difficult to understand because you want to put everything out to where everyone would love this but honestly even if a very large number of people are interested in what you're doing you're going to want to find a way to niche that down so you're dealing with a smaller segment because that specialization that intimate knowledge of that smaller group is what's going to allow you to communicate with them so much more effectively because you're one of them. You're, you're the man. You, you know what's up and you know what to tell them and your advice is good because you speak their language and you feel like one of the gang. And you actually will be because you know that smaller section rather than trying to deal with everybody on a larger scale it's even might be men versus women that something as simple as that but anyway you're much better off if you're specialized you want to get too specialized maybe but as a general rule the more you know the deeper you go into the market segment the more effective you're going to be at communicating with them the more they're going to love your stuff that's what gets them to buy all right, hope you're having fun. I'm up here in outer space, and I will talk to you tomorrow. I'm out.